fire ripped through the roof, hitting four alarms, the condo collapsing in front of firefighters. I just think that there was no sprinklers. The sprinklers didn't keep it in check. No activated sprinklers. It makes the third large fire this year of mid-rises built of wood frame construction. Others in Dorchester and Waltham, part of a growing list of cases around the country, sparking anger from local mayors. Wood frame construction is not right. Period. It's on the borderline of an epidemic, maybe. So something, something's going on. But the NFPA writes the national fire codes and says wood frame construction is not the problem. Instead, they say sprinklers should be turned on much sooner. As in this case, builders often wait until just before occupancy. Put some of the burden on the code official, but it really puts it on the building owner. They have to develop the plan. They have to train the workers. The developer of Woodstone Crossing has not yet responded to our request for comment. The state fire marshal continues to investigate. And while the 3 a.m. fire may suggest arson, fire safety experts say on-site security should have been available. I believe there is security on at Union Point, and uh, I'm not sure if they're at this particular site because this is a different builder. Depends on what building's being built. That's what I was told. And so now there is a push to force builders to turn those sprinklers on sooner as contractors finish each floor. Live in Weymouth, Sean Chai about WCVB News Center 5.